To know, to know. Somebody lift your hands and tell him, Lord, I wanna know you. Lord, I wanna know you better than I know me. Better than I know me. Teach me, Lord. To know, to know. Oh Lord, I wanna know you better than I know. Tell him, tell him, let me hear the church. so that you can give him glory hallelujah hallelujah if you are ready why don't we shout 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 hallelujah Ah! 
Usichokoze zaidi ya Zaidi ya hapa Higa ya sufi gala gala Shangwa na nalama Hey Geke watu tana apila ambia God is good Ambia God is good And we give him all the glory Amen Bwana asifiwe Praise the name of the Lord Nafikiri Simon Rose Tumtengeneze tu Siko tatu ya praise Tuimba paka watu waenda yukani I want to join this church. Which church is this? Yes. Amen. 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 Tuskizane hivi Tuskizane hivi For one minute you give God your best of shout Your best of jump Your best of your running Then we settle down for the word How many are ready for the word? For how many minutes? Ambe ya jirani moja Nani ya ukweli ni moja tu Only one minute Nani sukuone hapa Only one minute Are you ready to give God a sound of praise? Give Him a sound of praise! Glory! 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 
Nilikuanga technician wapi waya niz 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 Tutakuwa Simon Rose Take a break We finish the word You come back Ama aje Iko sawa Kama iko sawa sema iko sawa Amen 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 Just lift up those hands and thank God Give him praise, give him praise, give him praise. Give him praise, give him praise, give him praise. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for a wonderful time of praise, for a wonderful time of celebration. Lord, for a wonderful time of jubilation. We exalt you, we exalt you, Lord. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Lord, that we can express ourselves like David. Lifting up praise. Lifting up praise. From the young to the old. Lifting up praise. Lifting up praise. We are grateful. We are grateful. We are grateful, my Father. Lord, since yesterday, you have been good to us. Taking us, Lord, higher and higher and higher. And who knows, my Father, what you will, Lord, ultimately do with us. Even as we, Lord... Lord, bring down the curtains for this day. Receive the praise and receive the honor. You are forever glorified. The crown of glory, the diadem of beauty, the rose of Sharon, we worship you and we exalt you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I just want to usher in the next minister, and that is Reverend James Wanyonyi. Reverend James Wanyonyi is the founder and senior pastor of Breakthrough Family Chapel, Eldoret. He is the president of Legacy Ministers Academy, whose assignment is to be an instrument of revival in his generation. Reverend James Wanyonyi is married to Patricia Wanyonyi, blessed with one son, baby Kyle Israel. With a loud standing ovation, let's give a warm ass of welcome to Reverend James Wanyonyi. Is married to Patricia Wanyonyi, blessed with one son, baby Kyle Israel. With a loud standing ovation, let's give a warm ass of welcome to Reverend James Wanyonyi. your hands above your heads and in any language you know just begin to adore him tell him Lord I adore you I adore you I adore you she classic attend the crisis clan a gabasi cut in a magashi calibre bra my shantone glass in tana magashenda la la raba baba Rekle Santo Managashika Maganegase Katiribra Rima Santo Dandi Dende Kileleza Shandala Maganda La La Rama Shandala La La Raba Baba Begin to tell him that one thing you want him to do for you this particular evening Lord heal me Lord provide for me Lord deliver me Lord change my life Shantana managandi re 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 balala ra ba 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 ba. Shanto ne mna gashinda la 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 ra ba 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 ba. Shantana gande nde nde re gende le le gezinda. Maganta na mashinda na gande re re nde re re ba 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 ba. Shanda la gande re sande nde nde re gaza. Let situations bow. Let sicknesses bow. Let circumstances bow. Lord, show us your glory. Show us your glory. 
Show us your glory. Show us your glory. Show us your glory. Show us your glory. Show us your glory. Show us your glory. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Let's clap our hands for Jesus, everybody. Amen. May I once again appreciate Reverend Dan Likavo for the great for who you are in the body of Christ, the impact. Thank you for this opportunity together with dad and mom. God mightily bless you. Praise the name of the Lord. I say praise the name of the Lord. Tell your neighbor, neighbor, neighbor. when upon life belows you, you are tempestors, when you are discouraged, thinking all is lost, count your many blessings, name them one by one. Like it was at the beginning. Look at that other neighbor, tell them neighbor. Neighbor. Blessed assurance. Jesus, Jesus is, is mine. Whoa. the name of the Lord. I'm going to be very brief. May I invite my wife to pray before I... Hallelujah. If you believe in the God of the Bible, I want you to raise your hands to Jesus and agree with me as we pray. Our Father, in Jesus' name, Hallowed be thy name. We stand in awe of your presence. We thank you, Jesus, for your goodness in our lives. Today we ask the spirit of truth, come and fill us with knowledge and understanding. We ask that you guide us into all truth. I pray that today there will be a reconfiguration in our spirits, in our souls, and in our bodies. We receive the food of the spirits, which is the word of the Lord. We decree and declare that this seed shall be prosperous. We declare the vine will give its fruit. We declare heaven will give its due. And we declare that the earth will yield its increase. In the mighty name of Jesus, we ask the Lord you will speak through your servant, express through his body, your ever-living word of God. 
Come and heal today. Come and change today. Come and deliver today. Come and save today. We submit to you, Holy Spirit. And it is in the mighty name of Jesus we pray and we give thanks. Amen. 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 You may kindly be seated. Our Father has walked in the house. Let's appreciate him, please. Amen. I also came with uh, Apostle Dennis Ombugu from Nairobi. Let's appreciate. Thank you for coming. God bless you. Amen. I believe when we talk about worship and praise, one of the most important concepts or understanding we need to have is the issue of the glory of God. And I want to take a few minutes to share on this subject the riches that are in the glory of God. The riches that are found in the glory of God. Ephesians chapter number 3 and verse number 16. Ephesians 3 verses number 16. The Bible says that God or Christ, he will grant you according to the riches of his glory. But in this riches in glory, you will be strengthened with might by his spirit in the inner man. So this scripture establishes the fact that there is something called the riches of the glory of God. Philippians 4.19, a very popular verse. Philippians chapter 4, verses number 19. Again, Paul emphasizes, But my God shall supply all of your needs. But how? According to his riches in glory. So, the Bible is again clear that there is something called the riches of the glory of God. Romans 9, verse number 23. Romans chapter 9, verses number 23. And the Bible says, And that he, that he might make known the riches of his glory on the vessels of mercy which he had afore prepared unto glory. There are riches in the glory of God. What is glory? What is glory? Number one, when you talk about glory, we talk about the nature and the character of God. The glory of God is the nature. It is the character of God. It is who God is. Psalms 24, verse number 8 to verse number 10. Psalms 24, the Psalm of David, chapter number 24. Verse number 8 to verse number 10. Who is the king of glory? Telling you it is his nature to carry the glory. He is the Lord, strong and mighty. He is the Lord, mighty in battle. Can I hear an amen? Lift up your heads so he gets. Even lift them up, ye everlasting doors. Why? That the king of glory might come in. But the king of glory, the king who carries the nature and the character of glory shall be able to come in. What is the glory number two? The glory is the power of God. The glory is the power of God. 
the dunamis power of God. When we talk about the glory, we are talking about the power of the Almighty God. First Chronicles 29, verse number 11. First Chronicles chapter 29, verses number 11. Thine, O Lord, is greatness and power and the glory and the victory and the majesty. When we worship God, his power descends. His glory comes. I have a prayer this particular evening that somebody here will encounter the supernatural glory of God. Lift your hand and shout amen. What is glory number three? The glory of God is the presence of God. The glory of God is the presence of God. The glory of God is God in the midst of his people. Exodus chapter number 33, verse number 18. Exodus chapter 33, verse number 18. Exodus 33, verse number 18. And he said, I beseech you, I pray, O God, Moses is praying. I am making a cry. I am making an inquiry. You can show me many things. I have seen the Red Sea part. I have seen you appear to me in the bush of fire. But one thing I want you to show me, O oh God, show me your glory. Show me your glory. Lift your right hand, say, my Father, I ask you today, show me your glory. Pray from the bottom of your heart, say, Father, in the name of Jesus, show me your glory. Pray for 30 seconds for the glory. Shante na gandere re ba 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 ba. Shante ndandala ra ba 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 ba. We pray in this asaf. You will be shown the glory of God. Everybody say amen. What is the glory number four? The glory is the spirit of God. The glory is the spirit of God. The glory of God is the spirit of the almighty God. First Peter chapter 4, verse number 14. First Peter chapter 4, verses number 14. First Peter 4, verse number 14. If ye be reproached for the name of Christ, happy are you. Why? For the spirit of glory. And of God shall rest upon you. I pray today, no other spirit shall rest upon you. After this conference, the spirit of God shall rest over your life. I pray over your life today. After this conference, you will not carry the spirits of your ancestors. You will not carry the spirit of the age. She will not carry the spirits of the world. The spirit of glory shall rest upon your life. Somebody shout amen. Somebody shout glory. But the question now is, what brings the glory? What makes the glory of God come down? What brings the glory? Number one, prayer and fasting will bring the glory. Prayer and fasting will bring the glory. Prayer and fasting will bring the glory. I'll say that until I get an amen. Prayer and fasting will bring the glory. Psalms chapter number 63, verse number 1 to 3. Psalms chapter 63, verse number 1 to 3. Talking about fasting. Oh God. You are my God. Highly will I seek thee. My soul, my will, my emotions and my mind, they do pass after you, O oh God. My flesh longeth for thee in a dry 
and in a pasty land where there is no water. Why? To see thy power and to see thy glory. When you are praying and fasting, you download the glory of God. Somebody shout amen. Isaiah 58 verse number 6 to 8. Talking about prayer and fasting. Isaiah 58 verse number 6 to verse number 8. Is not this the fast that I have chosen to lose the bands of wickedness, to undo the heavy burdens, to let the oppressed go free, that you may break every yoke. The next verse says, it is not to deal by a hungry, to, the, to, to deal thy bread to the hungry, but thou may bring the poor that are cast out to thy house. The Bible says, when thou seest the naked, thou shalt cover him. Thou shalt hide not thyself, even from thy own flesh. The Bible says, then shall thy light or revelation break forth as in the morning, and your health shall spring forth speedily. I declare after today, may you enjoy divine health. The Bible says, and thy, and thy righteousness shall go before thee. The glory of the Lord shall be your reward. The glory of the Lord shall be your reward. Tell your neighbor, neighbor, if there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. And if there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. I pray for you today. I pray for you today that the grace of prayer will fill your life. I pray for you today, grace to fast for three days, grace to fast for seven days, grace to fast for 14 days, grace to fast for 21 days, grace to fast for 40 days, shall come over your life. You shall be a carrier of the glory of God. Do I have any prayer warriors here? Do I have any prayer warriors here? When you pray, the glory of God shall come down. If you want the glory of God, receive the grace of intercession in your life. I take authority over the powers of prayerlessness in our generation. I take authority over laziness in prayer. I take authority over the love of food. I declare over your life, arise and pray. Arise and fast. You shall see the glory of God. Tell your neighbor, neighbor, Ni wakati wa kufunga na kuomba. Ambia mwingine mwambie ni wakati wa kufunga na kuomba. I tell you today, there are people here who will fast until the glory of God comes down. Shout hallelujah. How do you get the glory? The knowledge of God brings the glory of God. Kumjua Bwana, the knowledge of God brings the glory of God. The knowledge of God brings the glory of God. Second Peter chapter 1, verses number 3. Second Peter chapter number 1, verses number 3. The Bible says, according as his divine power, has given unto us all things that pertain unto life and pertain unto godliness. But the Bible says, through the knowledge of him, by the understanding of him, he might call us to glory and to virtue. I pray today, you will know your God. I say you will know your God. 
for the people that do know their God. They shall be strong. They shall do exploits. Say, my father, you know we are in the Easter season. Say, my father, I pray that I may know you and the power of your resurrection. I declare today by the power of the glory of God, resurrection power shall happen over your life. Shout amen. Shout amen. How do you bring the glory number three? By building the house of God. By building the house of God. By serving God. By serving God. Someone say amen. Psalms 102. Verse number 16. Psalms 102. Verse number 16. Psalms 102. Verse number 16. When the Lord shall build up Zion, he shall appear in the glory of God. When Jehovah shall build up the church, he will appear in the glory. Somebody say amen. What we need now in the church is the glory of God. I emphasize again. Tell your neighbor, neighbor, what what we need now is the glory of God. What we need now is the glory of God. Enough of comedy. Enough of games. Enough of getting saved. Backsliding and getting saved. Enough of being a spectator. There are people here today. Jehovah will use you to build his house. A shout amen. Tell your neighbor, neighbor, serve God. Uh, we are Kuskiangia Mekuzoya. Tafta Mugina Mambia, neighbor, serve God. I always tell my people in the church if you serve God, He will service your life. If you serve God, He will service your life. The Bible says in the book of Job 36, verse number 11. Job 36, verse number 11. Somebody say, I will serve God. Kuna watu hapa ulikuwa kwa kwaya ukatoka. After this conference, you are going back to the house of God. Can I hear an amen? Kuna watu hata hii conference, you are going back to the intercessory team. You are going back to protocol. You are going back to the crusade. You are going back to the cases. When you serve God, build in the house of God, the glory shall come. The glory shall come. Pige Yesu sangwe na vikelekele. When you serve God, He will service your life. When you serve God, you will, He will service your life. Our bishop in the morning kept on telling us, for the years they have served God, they have seen rewards in life. You can't serve God and be a beggar. You can serve God and be a beggar. As you serve God, he will provide for your bread. He will clothe your life. He will give you a means of transport. Shout glory somebody. Shout glory somebody. What brings the glory number four? Sacrificial giving and generosity brings the glory of God. Sacrificial giving and generosity brings the glory of God. Second Chronicles chapter number one. Second Chronicles chapter number seven, sorry. From verse number one to two. Tell your neighbor, neighbor. Now, when Solomon had made an end of praying. After he said amen, the fire came down from heaven 
and consumed the burnt offering and the sacrifices. And after that, the glory of God filled the house. Giving releases the glory of God. Philippians 4 verse 15. We love this passage. Philippians 4 verse 15. Philippians 4 verse 15. I have seen giving change my life. Oh yeah. Totally 100%. I have testimonies if I told you, you'll think I'm lying. By giving. Giving to inconvenience yourself. Now you Philippians know also. But in the beginning of the gospel, when I departed from you, the Bible says to Macedonia, no church communicated with me as concerning giving and receiving. You are the only church that gave me something. Ah, Twenty Lake Dogo. The Bible says, <laughs> next verse, for even in Thessalonica, you sent once, and Pesa confirmed, Apostle Paul, you have received. You sent again unto my necessity. Ah, not because I desire a gift. But I desire fruit that may abound. Not to my account, but to your account. <laughs> the Bible says, but I have all, and I abound. I am full. Having received of a guy called Epaphroditus, things which were, things which were sent from you, these things were an odor of sweet smell, a sacrifice acceptable, well pleasing to God. Because of that, look at verse next verse. Because of your giving now, my God, my God shall supply all your needs. Not according to the economy of Kenya. Not according to your certificate. My God shall supply all of your needs according to his riches. Where? In glory. Today I declare over your life by the riches of glory. No more poverty in your life. No more lack in your life. Receive the grace uh, to become a giver. Sema ya makiva. Nakutangazia leo. Katika jina la Yesu Christo. Kabla hii conference haijaisha. Kabla hii Easter haijaisha. Pokea neema. Ya kupeana what you have never given. Ah. Uh, Washa nejaribu upande hii. Kwanzia leo. Pokea neema. Ya kutoa Kenya house white soa and my God shall supply how many needs how many needs I tell you today here he will supply a wife he will supply a husband he will supply a child he will supply a ministry he will supply a business according to his riches where in glory yeah nataka ukonge jirani yako msukume kidogo na kasira mwambie neighbor i will never be poor unajua kuna vitu zingine lazima useme na kasira eh sema neighbor i will never be poor another day of my life I will never beg you. I will never beg you. Another day of my life. After today, I am a giver. I am a giver. Receive your car. 
receive your house receive your children receive your blessings shout amen giving 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 brings the glory number five you are being blessed can I hear an amen operating by faith brings the glory operating by faith brings the glory santana gandere baba yende ga sendara baba john chapter 11 verse number 40 john chapter 11 verse number 40 the bible says john chapter 11 verse number 40 rasandandara baba Jesus talking to Mary. Didn't I tell you, my sister? Didn't I tell you, my brother? Jesus said unto her, said, I Lord unto thee, if you will believe, if you will believe, you will see the glory of God. Tell your neighbor you are about to see. Uh, you are about to see. We take our policy over the demon of uncertainty, the demon of fear, the demon of unbelief. Receive the grace of faith. Receive the grace of faith. Yesu, akenda kwa kaburi, akapata watu wanalia. Ni kama kuko kwetu western. People know how to mourn. Yay! Yeah! 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 Lazaro, Lazaro, hey, hey. Lazaro, Lazaro. Hey. Hey. When Jesus arrived at the gate, at the grave, someone say Amen. Yes, I could pick up my own become a mimi. Only going to come in Father. You are the God of the resurrection. Today I pray that you will do a miracle. No, Jesus came carrying the glory. I can say, Lazaro, Niaje. Lazaro si utokeleze. Lazaro akasema eh Lazaro akatokeleze. And I tell you today. And I tell you today. Biashara yako itatokeleze. Ndoa yako itatokeleze. Destiny yako itatokeleze. Shout I believe. I believe, I believe, Jesus said, all things, all things are possible to them that believe. Yote awezekana kwa imani. Yote yaweze kana Na mbouta enda Instructions brings the glory. Whoa. Obeying divine instructions brings the glory. John 2, verse 5 onwards. John chapter 2, verse number 5 onwards. Someone say, Amen. The Bible says in the book of John. His mother said unto his servants, Whatsoever he says unto you, discuss it. Does it say discuss it? 
whatsoever he says unto you, post it on Facebook, post it on TikTok. Whatsoever he says unto you, do it. Receive a do it anointing. The Bible says next verse, and there was set there six water pots of stone after the man of the purifying of the Jews containing two or three firkins apiece. The Bible says, Jesus said unto them, fill the water pots with water and they fill them up to the brim. The Bible says, and he said unto them, throw out now and bear unto the governor of the feast that they may bear it. The Bible says when the ruler of the feast had tested the water that was made wine and knew not where whence it was, but the servants which drew the water knew the governor of the feast called the bridegroom. And he said unto him, Every man at the beginning does set forth good wine. And when men have, and when men have drunk, then, then that which is worse, but thou hast kept the good wine even until now. The Bible says, This beginning of miracles did Jesus in Cana of Galilee. And he manifested the glory. Divine obedience. Whatever he tells you to do. Will bring the nature, the power, the presence of God. I don't know if you are to measure you are. Or be, or, or, or being, or, I'm trying to, to create a, an instrument for measuring obedience. If we can have obi, obediometer, obediometer, obediometer. Do we measure it in degrees or in, in temperatures or in a, a watch a 20 percentage? Percentage is easier. Ask your neighbor, neighbor, according to your obediometer, what is your score? Some of you here, God has spoken to you in a dream to leave that girl, Umekatalia. He has spoken to you, to you other person, Wachana nako kajama, Umekatalia. Leo kwa mkutano. Every relationship that is not of God, we cut it off. We cut it off. We cut it off. Somebody shout amen. Somebody shout amen. Ali kuambia kuanzia kesho nataka uamuke saa sita ya usiku ukiomba. Wewe saa sita ya usiku. Yeah, mega ogota. Ukiona wewe ni wale watu ukiamsha unakasirika. Wewe ni wale watu unaamkanga saa moja. Wanasema leo asubuhi imefika mapema. Hakuna asubuhi inafikanga mapema. <laughs> if he tells you to pray at midnight, if he tells you to fast at night, to fast in the day, whatever he tells you to do, do it. There are people here God has spoken to you for so long. Forgive that sister. Forgive that brother. It is the only thing hindering your miracle. No wonder you have no glory. I pray in this as of conference, the grace to forgive shall enter your life. Hallelujah. Number seven. Praise and worship brings the glory. Praise and worship brings the glory. This is why those of you who know God can sense there is some glory in this place. Someone say amen. Second Chronicles 5, verse number 12 to 14. Second Chronicles 5, verse number 12 to verse number 14. Second Chronicles chapter 5, 
verse 12 to verse number 14. Also the Levites, which were the singers, all of them of where? Of Asaph. Hey, hey, hey. Of Haman, of Jeduthun, with their sons and their brethren, being arrayed in white linen, having symbols and psalteries and harps, stood at the east end of the altar, and them with 120 priests sounding with the trumpets. Po, 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 po. It came to pass as the trumpeters and the singers were as one to make one sound to be heard in praising God and thanking the Lord. And when they lifted up their voice with the trumpets and with cymbals, the Bible says and instruments of music and they praise the Lord saying for he is good he is mercy and you are it forever but then the house was filled with the cloud even the house of the Lord somebody say amen so that the priest could not stand to minister by reason of the cloud. Why? For the glory of the Lord had filled the house. Ay, 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 ay. Why? Lord, you are good. And you are mercy, and you are it forevermore. They were saying, Lord, you are good, and you are mercy, and you are it forevermore. I pray for you today, you will enjoy the mercies of God. The mercies of God. Somebody shout, Amen. David said, Surely, goodness. Aha, 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 ay, 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 tell your neighbor, neighbor, after today, the goodness of God, the mercy of God shall follow you, shall follow you. Kwanzia leo, how fought in our ganga, how fought in our chawi, how fought in our nyoka, how fought in our kisrania. Where mana fabili, where mana fabili, sabwana sita kufwata, say amen, say amen, when praises go up, the glory comes down, hi, 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 when praises go up, the glory comes down, may the glory come, May the glory come. May the glory come. Shout amen. Number eight. Hey. Walking away from sin brings the glory. Good to see you, Pastor. Many years. Tell your neighbor, neighbor. Walking away from sin brings the glory. Romans 3 verse 23 Romans chapter 3 verse number 23 My God when you sin you fall short of the glory of God when you sin when you operate in sin you fall short of the nature of God for all have sinned and because of sinning, they have come short of the glory of God. Tell your neighbor, neighbor, achana na dambi. Ambia mungine mwambia achana na dambi. Ninatangaza kuanzia leo. Iyo roya kuokoka kiasi. Niluwa yenda kubiria mtu ni kamuliza umeokoka. Aniambia si sana. Kinadadio lakona imbanga. 
Sijui kama anakumbuka Simama Hima Aha Sima Aha Aha Usiwe kama bo Sinde Usiwe kama bo Juma bili Kanisani Juma tatu Kwaba Wee Wee usiwe kama bo But let's be serious for a minute. Uko na mamanzi wangapi? Let's be serious. Uliza mutu hapo, uko na machali wangapi? Let us be serious. Uh, uh, let us be serious. Apart from fresh, apart from, apart from mango, mango juice, apart from orange juice, what other drink are you taking? Ninatangaza kwanzia leo. Roya bangi imelaniwa. Chali watatu imelaniwa Roya upango wakando imelaniwa Roya uongo imelaniwa Roya kwasi wazazi imelaniwa I declare over your life Let the glory come Let the glory come Let the glory come In wami kono sema in the name of Jesus When I was praying when I was praying last evening for this meeting, I felt like God is telling me one of the things that are going to be broken here in this service are the spirit of addictions. When the glory of God comes, I declare that appetite for, for extramarital, premarital sex, that appetite dies today. I declare today, you are no longer addicted to pornography in your life. You are no longer addicted to secular music in your life. Father, show me your glory. Father, show me your glory. I pray over your life. No more carnality. No more sin in your life. There are people here today who will serve God by reason of the glory. Let me just take another few minutes. Sunday Reba Gatara Rababoya. Sunday Reba Setara Rababa. Isaiah chapter 60 from verse number one. That is why I want to stop. I can say so much, but time is against me. Isaiah 60, verse number one. Arise, my people. Arise, child of God. Arise, young girl. Arise, young student. Arise, pastor. Arise and sign. Arise and sign. After today, for the glory for the light has come and the glory of the Lord is risen upon you yeah. there are people after today you shall be like a city on a hill hey. there are people after today Ata wale ambao walifuta namba yako watatafuta namba yako Oh yeah Oh yeah Oh yeah Mwimbaji yake imba akasema walio kudharau siku moja watakusalimia kwa heshima Tell your neighbor neighbor if you knew who I am you will buy me dinner tonight. You will buy me dinner tonight. Arise. 
arise out of your average life arise out of your sins arise out of your addictions arise out of your tribesmen arise out of your clansmen arise out of your traditions thy light has come and the glory of the Lord is risen upon you verse number two after today for behold darkness shall cover the earth even gross darkness shall cover my generation but the Lord I say but the Lord but the Lord shall rise upon thee and his glory shall be seen ay 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 and the glory of God shall be seen in your life arise and shine it is very true we are living in the last days sin has engulfed the world we are living in the last days devil worshippers freemasons illuminati are all over the world we are living in the last days where people don't want our god but the bible says even though darkness shall cover the whole earth let the glory of god be seen over your life say my amen kuna watu hapa kwa sababu uliokoka familia yenu itapona kwa sababu uliokoka uchawi imeisha kwenu kwa sababu uliokoka arusi itafanyika ah. even though darkness covers the whole family the glory of the Lord. After today, when people see you, they will not see your problems. They will see the character of God. What killed your people cannot kill you. There is a glory that is over your life. What destroys young people of today shall not destroy you. The glory of God shall be seen over your life. Look at the next verse. The Bible says, And the Gentiles shall come to thy light receive the anointing to become a celebrity and uh, come up and your work receive the anointing to become a celebrity look about and Gentiles shall come to your light even kings leaders people of influence in the academic circle in the sports circle in the music industry shall come to the brightness of your rising why the glory of God look at that lift up thy eyes round about and see all they gather themselves together. What one itana wakuje kwako? What? Thy next verse, please. Thy son shall come from afar. Your daughters shall be nursed at by at your side. No more barrenness in your life. Then thou shall see and flow together and your heart shall fear and be enlarged why because of the abundance my agriculture teacher instead of saying cow dung he used to say cow dung so there are people instead of saying abundance they say abundance 
Jesus came that you might have life and have it more abundantly. Ah. They shall come, the abundance of the sea shall be converted unto you. And the forces of the Gentiles, supernatural wealth transfer. Shout glory! listened to Bishop for many years. One thing I like about him is the way he hates poverty. Tell your neighbor, hate poverty. Ambia mungina mwambia, hate poverty. Watu mungu, bana siwe sana. Hii roo unaenda, roo inatamani nguo. Inatamani suti. Unauliza suti ni pesa ngapi? 10,000. Hey! Aya. Letter 7,000. Hey! 5,000. Letter 1,000. Ukona miatano saa hini kupe. Ah, siku ingine. Iyo ro kwanzia leo ni meilani. in a tight budget. You will be operating in an abundant budget. When wale ukienda kununua nguo, hawangali chini. Yeah, yeah. When wale nasema, nataka ile, na nataka ile. Utafanya arusi paka mapepo hijue. Shoo. have one house the abundance of the sea ro inataka kuku na chips mfuku imekatalia matumbo ime samariswa of glory the abundance of glory shout amen so I'm able to make a sirika na umaskini oh make a sirika na unacheka angalia uyu I'm able to make a sirika na umaskini doctor Ro inataka saloon. Mfuke ni lazimisa ufanye nini? Najua, kwa hii maisha Pastor Dan, kuna kamunyama kana hitu wa paka. Paka ananga maneno. Siku moja wacha paka enu yukule maini ya wageni. Alafu uichukue, uifungie kwa bafu uanze kuitandika uyambie nita kutandika paka ujue maini ya wageni ukisai piga sana itafika maali utaona manyoya inaamuka utaona makucha inatoka ukiona hivo toka mbi iyo kitu itakumaliza maana imefika mahali pa kusema enough is enough enough is maisha ya kufungi wa nyumba enough maisha ya kulemewa na mapepo enough na prophesy over your life by the glory of God Receive your miracle. Receive your healing. Somebody shout amen. Mekiwa mdogo. Inakuwa napenda kuchunga ngombe. Siku juwa ndakuja kuwa mchungaji. 
Ukiona ngombe pale niipige niseme sui tware hata naweza mfunga miguu na nikamwe ile shule nilienda high school inaitwa French school kamsinga our school motto was use common sense common sense kati ya pastor Jemo na ngombe nani ana nguvu physical strength between you and an oxen who has more strength ngombe lakini ni kwa nini unaweza mpiga ende bado hajajua nguvu angejua angependuka aseme jemo tumezoea wanasema hata kuku angejua kuna mabawa kila christmas angefanya nini if you know what you carry if you know the name of jesus if you know the blood of jesus if you know the word of god if you knew who you are in christ you will declare enough is enough now i want to give you only two minutes whatever is disturbing you i want you to address it and tell it your season in my life is over tell that sickness stand if you can tell that disease tell that addiction tell that challenge enough is enough somebody lift your hands and pray lift your hands and pray I decree by the grace of God I am winning all my battles in the name of Jesus I decree by the power of the anointing I am overcoming every obstacle I am overcoming every challenge in the name of Jesus Tonight I receive a new grace to carry the glory of God I receive a new grace to carry the power of God I receive a new grace to carry the anointing of God in my life in the name of Jesus Masheka Tadiva Masikayanda by the blood of Jesus, every sin, I reject every sin in my life to carry the glory of God in the name of Jesus. Blessed be your name, O oh God. Thank you, Lord. Believe it. Close your eyes wherever you are. If 
Pastor Dan, you'll allow me. You are here and you are not born again. You know very well what we are talking about you cannot encounter until you give your life to Jesus. You know that you know that you know. You are tired of pretending. Before we pray the prayer of God to touch you with his glory, may I make an appeal to you to give your life to Jesus. It is appointed unto man who wants to die. After it, you have an appointment with God. Are you ready for the coming of Jesus? Are you living for yourself or you are living for Jesus? You are saying, Pastor James, even if I'm the only one who will get saved in Asaf, I make a permanent decision to give my life to Jesus. You know very well you're the one I'm talking about. Lift your hand. You are not saved. Thank you for, I see a hand there. I see a hand right behind there. Some more. You are not born again. Somebody help that sister to come. You are not born again. There is another hand right there. There is another hand right now. Why is why is There are people there who need to come. There are people there who need to come. There are people behind there. Right there, right there. Come to Jesus. walk out of your chair forget about where you came from who you came with and I want you to make this decision I made this decision as a small boy in Sunday school Jesus has done me well I don't preach because I'm poor I don't preach because I failed in school I preach because only Jesus is the way is the truth and is alive. You know very well you are not born again. You don't have a relationship with Jesus. He is not your friend. I want you to conquer your fear and your shame. Leave that place and you will never forget the step you are about to make. All to Jesus I surrender as we sing this song. Just come. Just ignore every other voice and just come. Young girl, come. Young man, come. Jesus. Just come. Just come. Just come. As I'm doing like this, the same way Jesus is calling you. He's saying, come, I have a plan for your life. Come, I have a destiny for you. Come, I will give you the life you want. Money will not satisfy you. Fame will not satisfy you. Just come. Just come. Just come. He, his presence, Just come. Just come. Just come. You know I'm talking to you. You know very well I'm talking to you. To give Yeah. 
If you're behind there, you are not too far. You are not too far. Just come. Just come. dying on the cross for me thank you for cleansing me from my sin today I make a decision to walk away from my sin I choose you as my personal Lord and Savior write my name in the book of life remove my name from destruction from this day, I declare the Lord Jesus Christ as my personal Savior. From this day, I am born again. From this day, I am saved by the blood of Jesus. No more sinful ways. I choose to live for you. I will live for you, Jesus, all the days of my life. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Can you put your hands together and appreciate Jesus? If you can just, all of you, if you can just stretch your hands to them even as you make this prayer in the name of Jesus. Heavenly Father, we thank you for these precious daughters, oh God, in the house. Thank you for these three wonderful ladies who have accepted you in their lives today. I declare today that no weapon of darkness shall ever prevail against their lives in the name of Jesus. I command every system of the enemy organized against their lives not to work anymore in the name of Jesus. I declare them, their lives covered by the blood of Jesus. From this day, I break every bondage of sin in their lives, Almighty God. And Holy Spirit, I ask you to fill them up today in the name of Jesus, that they can live for you victoriously, O Lord. I declare that they will live and not die to declare your praises all the days of their lives. From this day, they are covered to live for God all the days of their lives. In Jesus' name, we pray and believe. Come on, celebrate, celebrate. Celebrate, celebrate. Lift your hand wherever you are. Say, Father, show me your glory. Let it manifest in your life. Allow yourself to be healed of that sickness. Remove every mindset, every obstacle in your mind. Lose that appetite for that addiction. From the crown of your head to the very sole of your feet. Let asthma live your life. 
Let ulcers leave your body. Depression and stress of life. Evil cycles, witchcraft, entanglements. Jesus is tapping you at the shoulder right now. He's doing a work no man can do. The glory of God is coming on you. The power of God is coming on you. Lord, show people your glory here. Supernatural visitations. Divine encounters. Revelation of knowledge. God is increasing your wisdom. Supernatural wisdom. It is happening to you right now. Your prayers of many years are being answered now. That special day you are waiting for. This is the day. Be filled with the Holy Ghost. Let demons leave your body. Let forces leave your brain. Fire on your belly. Fire on your belly. Jesus is appearing to you. 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 Give him the glory. Give him the glory. Give him the glory. I know we are running out of time. We just take two minutes if you'll allow me. Because our Father is here. I just feel it in my heart, Dad, if you'll allow. You're behind there and you know very, very well you have a calling to be a minister. Just raise your hand. You, you know it. I'm not talking about those people who love ministry or... But even people are not aware that you have it. But deep inside your heart you feel you're going to end up as a minister. Just lift your hand. I'll ask Papa to come and make a prayer for us. And when he calls me, I will answer. into seriously when you know there is a call of God upon your life is to have quality time of preparation there is the calling there is preparation and there is commissioning so I would like you to invest your life and your time into preparation and one of the ways of preparation is to serve serve God but serve a human being. You know what I mean is serve God but serve somebody. Elisha served God but he served Elijah. And the Bible says Elijah 
that means he was taking care of his business kuna mwito kuna kuandaliwa na kuna kutumwa watu wengi wanaitwa na kuanza ni kama nanasi aijaiva nanasi ni nanasi tu ama maembe lakini lazima iive kwanza ndio watu wa, 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 wa ile i hope you understand kama kama nanasi aijaiva kwa mdomo inakuwa kali lakini kama imeiva inafurahiwa Just for pray I, I want let me let me just say that thank you for that understanding During my ordination service in Nassau in Nassau in 1997 Nassau Bahamas by Dr. Miles Monroe and by Menzo Otabiga and others I remember when I was kneeling over there and around that time Dr. My, Miles said something He said the gifts in you the bible says you know the gift will make a way and he said the gift in you just serve it as god begins to prepare you give it to people give it but serve somebody as you serve god serve somebody those words have never left me it's about 20 some 27 years ago or something i had an ordination earlier but because of the relationship i requested for that there is serving and it matters elisha served elijah elijah because in elijah was what elisha needed it was not in some and for those of you who are called of God I want to pray for you that the Lord will give you understanding understanding so that your calling your preparation your commissioning will happen correctly if you skip any of them there is a danger of crashing ahead and I think some of us have seen a lot of that So stretch up your hands for those of you who had your hands up and say with me father in the name of Jesus I appreciate your call over my life I pray this evening I may not have all the details but I give myself to you and to your service your word says If I am faithful in what belongs to somebody else you will give me my own help me to be faithful with that which belongs to somebody else amen father i pray that these men and women who sense your calling upon their lives will give themselves to due process understanding the call investing in the season of preparation and being commissioned into the world of ministry let there be no delay in any of those places let there be no frustration and if there be some who are being frustrated now because of the environment in which they find themselves maybe the organizations have structures and systems that are intimidating maybe those above them for whatever reason don't want to give them opportunity i pray father that like peter said should we honor men or honor god let these people begin to honor you and bring you glory because every day of their lives is a day of investment in the kingdom let there be no day ahead of them which is going to be wasted but let every day be productive and be effective therefore I bless them in the name of the father the son and the holy spirit amen amen
as I appreciate our father once more, better in a better way. We have learned that one of the best ways to receive the glory of God is by giving generously. I want you to worship the Lord this particular moment with a very special Asaf offering. By this offering you are saying, everything I've received in Asaf shall be manifested in my life. Say amen. I want you to go to your wallet, take the biggest note you have, or several of those. If baskets are around, please do so. The details are on the those of us who are giving via Mpesa details on mobile transactions, the details are right on your screens. Just go ahead as 428-7100 is the ASAP till number. Those of us who have our offerings with it in our hands, just come and put your offering in the nearest basket. There's a basket here. There is one here. Let's go ahead in the name of the Lord. As we the, give you glory, Lord. It's giving time. As we honor you. Kingdom investment time. We give you glory, Lord. As we honor you. You are wonderful. Let's go ahead and give. You of your people, we declare it is blessed. Wherever it came from, Father, we ask that you will replenish. We give you praise and we give you honor. In Jesus' name, we do pray and believe. And somebody say, Amen. Amen. Man of God, thank you for that powerful word. The Lord continue to expand your frontiers, lift you as you serve the ministry of Christ. Thank you. Um, we, uh, our time is really gone and we will not have any break. Uh, for about 15 minutes, about 20 minutes, uh, we want to give a man of God 
Dr. Ipiano opportunity just to come and minister to us. Yeah, praise the name of the Lord. So can we all uh, be upstanding as we receive the man of God to come? After so much has happened in this place and a lot of impartation, I just want us to thank God for a few minutes, then we be getting out of this place. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Tumwambie baba tunakushukuru. Hallelujah. Tuseme nini baada ya haya yote aliyoyafanya. Hatuna maneno mazuri ya kumwambia zaidi ya kusema tunakushukuru. Hallelujah. Sante sana Baba once again for the opportunity, the preach of the day. Na ministers wote ambao wameanza toka asubuhi mpaka sasa kuanzia Pastor Dan. Uh, fellow worshipers, God bless you. Na wote mehudumu nasi, barikiwe sana. Hallelujah. 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 Can you tell it? Come on. Yeah, Baba Nina Kushu Kushu
Him in advance instead of putting those prayer points, one be Lord. I thank you in advance for my marriage, I thank you for my career, thank you for my studies. Release your, your prayers in form of thanksgiving. One be a Sunday because I see myself being crowned with a degree. Malazikata. Shalaba anto roprodaza. The enemy drawn. Arichoram star. Ili nisivuke. Kwenda kwenye level ya degree. Aritaka nishe uh, diploma. Aritaka nishe level flani ya maisha. Lagini skupitia dami ya yesu. I'm here to say thank you. For giving me opportunity. And crowning me. And <laughs> commissioning me. With a new name, Makatu, make a say, let's okay. Package your prayer in front of Thanksgiving. Package your prayer in front of Thanksgiving. See, hey, let's say, yeah, carry a Find 
Pamoja mara ya mwisho umefanya hili umefanya lile umenipa jina baba nina kushuku one more time raise your voice umefanya hili umefanya hili umefanya hili umenipa jina baba nina kushuku kama bwana amekupa jina inua hiyo sauti yako ompigie bwana shangwe na vikelekele ya usiende pigie yesu vikelekele ya usili hallelu amen 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 we thank god for that powerful uh, session uh, turn your turn to your neighbor and tell them Asaf is not yet over. Wambie, wambie, we still have tomorrow to go. Yeah, God bless you, man of God. I believe they will be in our services beginning as early as eight. Uh, in the first service and in the second service, we'll still have our brother and sister John Aler and also Dr. Ipiana. So uh, make that appointment and be here praise the name of the lord yeah we also want to appreciate the servants of god who have ministered to us yes in the afternoon also we have um asaf worship experience two to six yeah so we appreciate the men of god uh, who are with us even this wonderful day uh, let us allow our ministers to uh, file out first let us give them an opportunity they have done good work let us celebrate them as they exit amen I see Bishop Zablon amen 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 thank you for coming and gracing this as of uh, 2024 uh, Tuko sawa. Hallelujah, tuko sawa. Geukea ujirani muambie kama sio wewe Asaf haingewezekana. Muambie ni vile wewe ni mrembo, vile wewe ni mwasam. Ai 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 ai. Muambie tu umeongezea kwa picha iko sawa. Amen, 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 amen. We want to exit by uh, sharing the grace. Are you ready for the grace? So geukea ujirani muambie Mwambie tu kesho tena hapa. Sisi mwambie tu. Mwambie upload yako atutaki mwingine si tutubuki in advance. Amen. God bless you so much. Let us share the grace together and now may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. Have a wonderful evening. Stay safe.